Nebraska in white. They have their scarlet football pants. Oklahoma on the right with crimson jerseys and white pants. We hope you're watching in color. You're comfortable. And as soon as that ball is touched, the game will be underway. Johnny Rogers in his own end zone. 5, 10, 15, 20. Coming out to the 25. And he was denied about five yards of his Pomona just outside the near side tackle. We have Cox also outside. So from the 26-yard line, first down, Nebraska. Jerry Taggy. And his very first pass is completed to Johnny Rogers. A test for the Nebraska defense right off. Rogers to the far side. Taggy. And a two-yard play. All right, number 45 in white, Bob Terrio. Tim Welch is in at fullback for Oklahoma. Third and seven for the Sooners. And the wishbone is being effectively defensed by the Nebraska Go unit. Back to punt, Johnny Rogers, number 20. He uh, returns punts as well as kickoffs. It's high in the air, which is what uh, Wiley wanted to do, so there'd be kick coverage, and Rogers gets away. Look at that. Johnny Rogers. Look at the moves by that sensational player, a native of Omaha, and he is going, going, gone. Terrio drew the last block that got Johnny Rogers into the Oklahoma end zone and Nebraska number one leads six to nothing after about 75 yards. Jerry Taggy. Taggy has waltzed right back to me. Second down and 10 for Nebraska at the 44 of Oklahoma. Seven to three the score, Nebraska. Nice fake by Taggy. Flips it then at the last moment to Kenny. Single setback. He carries the ball and gets the first down. The ball carrier is even ahead. Usually the ball carrier wins the battle and knocks the linebacker back. And the slot eye. Taggy fakes and throws down the middle. Look to be Woody Cox, number 32. Wait till we see the jersey. Correction, it's number 20. Johnny Rogers. The slot eye again to the near side of the field. What faking by Taggy. First and goal now for the Cornhuskers. And Jeff Kenny carried on the play. Kenny, the number one rusher for the Cornhuskers with 807 yards and 12 touchdowns. Gets it down to about the one. This drive started at the Nebraska 46. Second and goal. Jeff Kenny, touchdown, Nebraska. 13 to three. And for Kenny, it's his 13th touchdown of the year. The senior from McCool, Nebraska. Held back today, and let's see what the Sooners can do now. First and 10 from the 20. Mildred on the wishbone. But as Mildren saw the defensive moves unfolding, he flipped out to Pruitt, but Jim Anderson, number 18 of Nebraska, was not fooled. Second down to 10 from the 20. And there is Leon Crosslight, who injured himself earlier, but is back in. Blahock made the tackle at the 45, make it the 44 as Leon Crosswhite went 22 yards and a first down. Dutton is in a tackle replacing Jansen on 35 from the 49. Jack Milden gets the first down from Nebraska. First down, Oklahoma. Crosswhite angling off across the first leading 14 to 3 with 7.44 to go in the first half. Milden, first down for Oklahoma. And boy, when things do break with the wishbone, they happen in a hurry. But that is just beautifully executed. Leon Crosswhite, the junior from Hennessy, Oklahoma, moves right down to the five-yard line. 13th play of this drive coming up. There it is. Just waltzes in. 
Jack Milvin of the Sooners. And some block by Crosslight. Wasn't it beautiful? His 14th touchdown rushing. He is nearing the 1,000-yard rushing mark. The quarterback, Jack Mildred. Dan Kroger, number 46, charging out to the 35. Not enough for the first down. Clock running. First down play. Mildred looking to throw. Loops one out. It's coming in the area of Harrison. He has it. Harrison, as a helmet goes shooting out, the defender, number 24, Bill Cush, lost the helmet, and the play goes to the 24-yard line of Nebraska. Let's look at it again. There was a trade inside running fake here. Harrison just drifting down the field, then turning it on. Pope went back, didn't quite see the ball, overran it. That's Cush overrunning it. First and ten with the clock running, and there is a touchdown, Oklahoma John Harrison. I wouldn't have believed that, Chris. 78 yards, four plays, showing you the explosiveness of the wishbone offense. And Jack Milgren coming into this game had only completed 22 of 45 passes, but he ripped Nebraska with two passes in particular to take the lead. Number 12, this is Harrison going downfield, and he clearly beats Kosh here. Mildred, after the running fake, put it perfectly on target. Mildred is four of six for this afternoon. Seven. Kenny, tough man to stop. First and 10 from the 42, Nebraska. Taggy, for about three yards. Rogers is flanked to the far side. Cox is split to the near side with Kenny in the slot. Single setback. Taggy gets the first down and more. Jerry Taggy. Moving his way down inside the five as Kenneth Pope forced him out of bounds. First and goal for the Cornhuskers at the three of Oklahoma. Kenny and Olds at the setback. Look at that move. Jeff Kenny pulling away from everyone for a three-yard touchdown rump. And now it is 20 to 17 as Nebraska has regained the lead here in the third quarter. Let's watch Kenny again. It doesn't look like there's any daylight at all. But he finds that crease as Olds makes a beautiful block for him. Now as Oklahoma, Oklahoma has a third down and four. Ball between the 30 and 35. And Mildred, Willie Harper. Pinches in from his right defensive end position. And in case of help, Jim Branch, number 51, was there. Nebraska at their own 39, first and 10. Dam Kroger, Maury Dam Kroger, number 46, who was alternated fullback with Bill Olds, carried on the play. Kenny and Dam Kroger are the setbacks. Kenny going wild here in the second half. In the Oklahoma 36. What a catch by Johnny Rogers. Down and 10. Taggy, receivers covered. Mark Driscoll making the tackle at about the 11 yard line. Another five yard pickup. Five at the 11 of Oklahoma. Here's the pass. Johnny Rogers short of the Oklahoma goal line, trying to cap a 61-yard drive as they now have a first and goal at the half-yard spot. It darkens here in Norman, Oklahoma, getting uh, more overcast as Anderson goes to the left. Kenny and Dram Kroger are the setbacks, and Taggy tries to go in. To credit the whole middle of the Oklahoma defense, including yeah. Raymond Hamilton. A first down that close to the goal line, Chris. Many coaches don't believe there's any point in taking a chance on handing the ball to anyone else. The quarterback ought to be able to get it over from the first down on the one-yard line. Jerry Taggy, 215-pound, 6-foot-2-inch quarterback from Green Bay, Wisconsin. Second and goal from the half. Jeff Kenny goes in. 
So Jeff Kenny has scored the last two touchdowns for Nebraska. Just beyond the 33. It's a third down and five for the Sooners. 229 to go in the third quarter. They trail by 11. And here is a pass thrown, and it is complete to John Harrison. Harrison trying to get away. Can't. But Oklahoma has moved to the 15 of Nebraska. Oklahoma has the first down. A 41-yard play to the 16 of Nebraska. First down. The exciting wishbone. Mildred. Look at him pick his way between folks, which is unheard of. That much yardage against Nebraska. Second and two. Mildred, his own number again, and it appears that he has the first After down. After trailing in the ball game, 21 to 17 at halftime. Touchdown, Jack Milgren. So the Boomer Sooners go marching from their own 28. A 72-yard drive in seven plays. He's remaining in the third quarter, and the kick by Carroll is up and good. A record-breaking crowd here. The last bigger crowd was in 1957, but... When you were the coach, and it was Notre Dame that day that stopped your 47-game winning streak. I remember the afternoon very well. It was gray and overcast, almost like this one. Let's watch the touchdown again. You can watch the blocking here of the wishbone backs as they cut the pursuit down, enabling Mildren to move into the end zone. For now the touchdown. powerful and number one ranked Nebraska Cornhuskers, first and ten at their own 20. Their super engineer and quarterback, Jerry Taggy, has the ball. Pitches it to the deep man, Kenny. And Kenny, it's that extra four <laughs> yards he gets, Chris, after the ordinary back would be down. Get down at seven for Nebraska. Taggy is 14. 20 is Johnny Rogers. 85 is List to the far side. Cox, 32 to the near side. Uh-oh, here's Johnny Rogers coming the opposite way. There's that blinding speed out of bounds at midfield on a 16-yard gain. Fullback. Kenny behind him. The fake is to Kenny, and the defense took it. Here's Taggy. Taggy still trying. Ooh. And once again, Oklahoma loses leverage rushing the passer. They had him, but Taggy had a little bit more speed than Day coming in. Third and inches. Slot eye. <laughs> Jeff Kenny getting yards inside the 25 of Oklahoma. Covers the ball. To 11 at quarterback. And Jack Milton is moving. John Atkins went right along Second with Second down and five for Oklahoma near midfield. And there is the first opportunity to see the speed of Greg Pruitt. What a play. The near side on third and five. Milton. And it's Welsh. Battles, but is short about a yard and a half of the first down, bringing up fourth oh, down. Go for it. They need uh, almost two yards. 8.51 to go in the ball game as Oklahoma trails by four. The wishbone offense with Harrison split at the bottom of your screen, number 12. Gotta go wide, I think. And there's the first down by the bread and butter man, Jack Milgram. Third and six. And knocked away on a beautiful play. Number 18, Jim Anderson, a senior from Green Bay. It was intended for Albert Chandler. He may run the basic option or a pass off the fake. They need six yards. Mildren busting one out here to a man who's open. It's a touchdown, Oklahoma lead. The game for number one. We'll continue here on ABC in a moment. The score, Oklahoma 31. Nebraska 28, Oklahoma 31, Nebraska 28. 
Nebraska number one in the rankings, Oklahoma number two, second and six from the 30, Jerry Taggy. Jeff Kenney, now Nebraska third and one at their own 35, Taggy. That's a good man to give it to when you need a yard or more. Look at that power runner, Jeff Kenney. I've gone 29 games without defeat. Nice fake by Taggy. Jerry List is going deep, but the receiver is covered. But then coming up short was Rogers on a comeback try. Off the shoulder pad. Third down and eight for Nebraska. 4.50 to go. Third down and eight. A lone setback with two wings out and in going out now. Taggy, oh, just missed. Again by 96 Hamilton. Johnny Rogers caught the ball and it's a Nebraska first down Catches and a 59 yards for Rogers. First and 10 at the Oklahoma 36. Frosty Anderson is in the lineup split to the near side. There's the Rambler. Can't he move? Jeff has first and 10. Cornhusker, 3.59 to go in the game. They trail by three. Look at this run. Johnny Rogers slipping away, falling to the 15. The far side, Rogers is uh, an inside slot man on second and three from the 15. And that's the man to give it to. Jeff Kenny, the first and goal from the Oklahoma 8. Jeff Kenny, Other side as a split end is Woody Cox in the slot eye formation. Jerry Taggy, number 14, Colson. What a man to stop. Jeff Kenny, a fumble. Oh. And Oklahoma players say that they've recovered it, but the officials say Third no. and goal from the two. What pressure on the Oklahoma defense. Not to be denied, Jeff Kenny, his third touchdown of the afternoon. And Nebraska has regained the lead. Their own 19 with a first and 10. And Mildren immediately wants to go to the air, throwing it long off. Oh, Harrison had his man beaten, but the pass was overthrown. And 10 for the Sooners. Mildren. And Mildren is near the sideline after about a four-yard gain by four, a minute 21 to go. And a number one defensive unit in the nation, led by Larry Jacobson, number 75, throw Mildren for the loss inside the 15-yard line, bringing up fourth down. This from the wishbone. Fourth down and 14. Mildren looking. Mildren getting away. The ball knocked down by... Guess who? Rich Glover, number 79. Players are happy and well they should be.